Hi, I'm Gloriana, and I'm here today to talk to you about uniforms. Uniforms are important for several reasons. They provide a consistent image for customers, and they identify you as a team member. Uniforms help staff and customers determine your role as an employee. Uniforms also keep you from ruining your personal clothes. The things that we are going to talk to you about today are true regardless of which uniform you wear. Let's start at the top with head covering. When working in any food preparation or serving area, hair must be covered by an approved head covering. This can be a hat or a visor, or in the case of kitchen staff, a chef hat or culinary skull cap. In all cases, the head covering should be clean, and if it has a bill, the bill must be facing forward. If you have long hair, it must be tied back. Hair bands, head scarves, hair curlers, and other unapproved headgear are not allowed. The appropriate type and color of pants and uniform shirt for your classification must be worn. These need to be cleaned and wrinkle-free. Student employees may wear shorts so long as they are knee length. If your uniform becomes stained or dirty while working, ask your supervisor for direction. Sportswear type pants and shorts are not allowed. You are required to wear shoes that cover and protect the entire foot. The top part of the shoe must be leather or another solid material to protect the foot from hot liquid or chemical spills. Shoes with an oil and slip resistant sole are preferred but not required. You may not wear dance shoes, sandals, shoes with open toes, or shoes with open heels. Heels must cover at least one and a half inches of the heel. Shoes with heels or soles that raise the foot one and a half inches or more from the floor must not be worn. The goal is for shoes to be protective as well as comfortable. Good personal hygiene and grooming are an essential part of your uniform. You should arrive at work clean and looking your best. Fingernails should be clean and trimmed. Earrings, large rings, bracelets, neck chains, and other jewelry must be removed before starting work. Loose jewelry can become caught in machinery or contaminate food products. As a rule, earrings larger than a quarter must not be worn. ID badges are a required part of your uniform. They identify you as a university employee and help make our facilities more secure. All employees working in food service or production should wear a clean apron. Laborers and dishroom staff may also find it beneficial to wear an apron. Aprons should be changed any time they have become soiled. It is important to take your apron off before entering a restroom or taking a break. Okay, that brings us to the end of our video. Always keep this in mind. How we look directly affects how our customers feel about the product we serve. If we are clean and looking sharp, the food we serve will be more appetizing. Thanks for watching.